It's quiet out here. And there's not a cloud in the sky, is there? There's not. It's cloudless. It's cloudless. I'm looking for prickly pears. Now that they've released an insect to kill the Patterson's curse, there are more prickly pears coming up everywhere I've noticed, so I'm going to find one. Once I find one, I'll, I'll bookmark it so that I know where it is, and I'll come back when there's fruit. Look at the beautiful cloudless sky, look at it. Nothing, no, not a cloud anywhere. Anyway, let's go down that way and look for a prickly pear, because I, I think I saw one down there. I think I did. I saw something that looked like it from a distance. Let's go and have a look. Here we are, all handheld. That's an apuntia, that's a prickly pear. Apuntia, whatever it is, the Latin, botanical Latin. I'll have to come back when it's got flowers and fruit on it, won't I? That's definitely a prickly pear. And they're starting to spread because the Patterson's curse doesn't take over everything anymore. So there's more prickly pear around. I'll come back for some bush tucker, won't I? I will. Don't want to get all spikes in my lens, do I? So, that's what I've discovered. Bush tucker. Of course the pads can be eaten too, but you've got to burn all the pads off with a gas flame or something. Well, that's something to look forward to anyway. I'll come back when it's got fruit and flowers on it. That'll be nice. See ya. At least it can stand the heat here, can't it? It's so hot and dry. I'm just about to wilt. But I've got a bottle of water with me just in case, in case I do wilt. Bye again.